Hello everyone, welcome to the Mathematics MI channel. In this video, we are going to find the, uh, the special value of uh, digamma function, digamma of one half. Okay, mm, how to begin? Well, uh, first uh, I am going to recall the legendary duplication formula of uh, gamma function. We know gamma of m times gamma of uh, m plus one half is equal to square root of pi times gamma of 2 times m over 2 raised to the 2m minus 1. In a previous video, uh, I proved this identity duplication formula. Uh, if you like to watch that video, I will add the link in the description and also make a card. Well, uh, then as a next step, uh, I am going to isolate the gamma of 2m. So, we have gamma of 2m is equal to uh, 2 raised to the 2m minus 1 over square root of pi times gamma of m times gamma of m plus 1 half okay then uh, i'm going to apply uh, natural log uh, both side so here we have natural log of gamma of 2 times m is equal to now according to property of natural log uh, right hand side we can simplify uh, like uh, here natural log uh, 2 to the 2m minus 1 2m minus 1 we can write in front of natural log so 2m minus 1 times natural log of 2 then plus natural log of gamma of m plus natural log of gamma of m plus uh, 1 half then in the denominator we have square root of pi so uh, we know 5 to the 1 half so 1 half minus 1 half natural log of pi well then uh, i'm going to differentiate both side with respect to m so here we have natural log of gamma function so we know if we differentiate uh, natural log of gamma function gamma of x we will have digamma of x uh, we already discussed about that uh, well uh, then uh, let's um, differentiate so here we have now uh, you know digamma of 2 times m but uh, we should uh, multiply by the coefficient of m so here 2 times digamma of 2m is equal to uh, if we differentiate this part we know we have only 2 times natural log of 2 then here uh, we know digamma of m so uh, digamma of m plus then this part we know digamma of m plus one half and this part we know constant so derivative uh, will be uh, zero well uh, let's plug in a uh, one half for m so here we have two times uh, digamma of now two times one half we know one so one uh, is equal to here two times natural log of two plus digamma of uh, one half plus digamma of one half plus one half we know one okay uh, in a digamma function previous video uh, we talked about the value of digamma of one we prove digamma of one is equal to minus gamma gamma we know Euler's mass coronary constant so you can watch uh, that video um, by searching my digamma video series well so here we have digamma of one digamma of one we know minus gamma so minus two times gamma is equal to two times natural log of two plus uh, digamma of one half uh, here digamma of one again minus gamma okay then uh, if you isolate the digamma of one half we know uh, this is equal to minus two times gamma plus gamma so minus gamma minus two times natural log of two okay this is the value of digamma of one half thank you for watching